Croatia is a place of rich culinary traditions and local food specialties, which are produced by small-scale farmers. The Croatian Ministry of Agriculture wants to promote and protect these unique products through the development of geographical indications. Geographical indications is a mechanism which protects the certain name of the product and this is linked to the traditional method of production and to the specificity of the territory where the product is produced. Worldwide, the market of geographical indication products is estimated at 50 billion euro. The protection of geographical indication labels is ensured in 80 countries. On average, geographical indication can increase the value of a product by 30%. Croatia is a small country that has very fragmented land. So the average land holding in Croatia is 2.6 hectares, which makes it very difficult for the local producers to compete on a large scale in the traditional commodities, such as the corn, rapeseed, wheat. Geographical indication, they really, really give the opportunity to the local producer to have a niche quality products that they can market, price at a premium and access the wider network. So in the context of the European Union, it is also important because it helps to integrate the Croatian primary agriculture into the European markets. To promote and protect Croatia's traditional agri-food products, the Food and Agricultural Organization of the United Nations and the European Bank for Reconstruction and Development have joined forces with Croatia's Ministry of Agriculture, Agricor, Croatia's leading agribusiness company and groups of producers to help develop Croatia's first geographical indication. The project helped these producers register two pilot products, the Kulin sausage from the Baranja and mandarins from the Nureta Valley. Since the 1960s, FAO has helped Nuretva farmers with land improvement and the introduction of mandarins. These mandarins have now become famous. The specificness of these mandarins is that they are found in the Dolini Neretve, which is found in the vicinity of the sea, and its sweetness, the sweetness of the water on which they are found, is that the mandarins give the mandarins a special drag, which they don't have in the rest of the land. And we, in the Dolini Neretve, in a special way, we keep our old ways of keeping Tu mandarinu želimo zaštititi, tako da se moramo bolje plasirati na evropsko tržište. The kulen is made out of premium pork meat, which is ham, and that makes 90% of the ingredients. 10% is the fat, pork's fat, and we add a mixture of spices to it. Uh, the most characteristic one is the red paprika, which is uh, traditionally homegrown here. And we also add uh, some garlic, uh, pepper, and salt. And that's all that goes inside. Kulin is uh, a very traditional product for this region. And it's been made here for many generations. Uh, and it's also been made here in my family for many generations. And uh, it's a very uh, specific and high quality product, which is uh, used, consumed only in special occasions. Under this project, we did a study tour to Italy where we observed three different typologies of uh, producers which have products certified under the geographical indications. This whole experience showed me where our project can go here in Croatia. We had some uh, training activities uh, such as uh, food safety, HACCP, uh, similar topics. We had them develop the code of practice, which is a document which specifies all the characteristics necessary to protect the geographical indication of a product. And we provided support to the ministry, especially to the team which runs the geographical indications in the ministry and also for the commission which is in charge of protection of geographical indications. Trainings were about how to develop a specification or code of practice. Uh, how it works uh, process of uh, certification, uh, how works uh, process of accreditation of certification bodies and the whole uh, process of uh, recognition uh, with uh, GI. Zemljopisne oznake jamče prepoznatljivost i kvalitetu tradicijskih proizvoda sa određenog područja. We also carried out a number of promotional activities on the national level in order to raise the awareness about the concept of geographical indications. 
Hard work has paid off. Through this project, the Noretva Mandarins and Baranja Kulin are among the first Croatian products to achieve protected geographical indication status. This will pave the way for other traditional Balkan products to access the global market. The good thing, you know, which we realized on the way, like a side, it was that several other products in parallel starting the process of recognition, that in the meantime other producers from other sectors organized themselves, recognized the value, and started to do to the same project. That is one. And on the other, that we increase administrative capacity and also the number of companies which could help in the process, private companies which will be in the future involved into the process of control. We practically on the way move a lot of other things which were not only directly connected with the project. I think that's the biggest value overall.